everyone. So for today's episode, I did a little shopping at H&M, picked up a few pieces that really caught my eye. Kind of a mix of some interesting pieces that have some fun detail to them. So if you do have a more capsule wardrobe and wanted to add some fun, kind of funky pieces for the summer months, I grabbed a few things that'll fit the bill there, as well as a few um, staple pieces that are really great to have for the summer months. So I'm gonna go through and try everything on for you and chat through fit, what I'm liking, not liking about each of the pieces. So let's try some stuff on. All right, first up, I grabbed these boxer style shorts. They are a satin fabric, which I really love, kind of the lightweight movement to them. The watercolor design is really what caught my eye. I think it's so pretty. They look very expensive. Um, they even have the button detail here. Elastic waistband. I ordered an extra small. I mean, they fit, but they are a little bit snug on the waistband, so I would probably opt for a small just to get a little bit more room and not have any kind of overlap here. But I really, really like the quality of these. I feel like they are very chic, perfect for vacation. So why don't I try them on with a linen shirt and see how that looks. But these are definitely a win. All right, so here is a linen shirt that I picked up. I'm obsessed with this shirt. It is a little bit of a higher price point for H&M because it's 100% linen. Uh, it was about $114, but the color is very pretty. Sometimes a stark white after a few washes can start to look a little bit worn or if you mix it you know, with something else in the wash, it loses its brightness. So I kind of like the idea of doing this oatmeal color um, as an alternative. The detail in this shirt is so, so expensive looking. Uh, the wider sleeve detail, absolutely love. The brown buttons give a nice contrast to the color of the shirt. And just the oversized fit allows you to wear this as a beach cover up. You can wear it with little shorts underneath, um, pair it with a few different things in your wardrobe. You can layer it over um, a fitted tank or t-shirt with a pair of jeans. So even with these shorts, it looks cute. I mean, obviously if you just kind of leave it like this, it's looking a little bit sloppy, but if you do a little bit of tucking like so, at least then you get to see the waistband, a little bit of shape added in, judge it a little bit so that it fits nice. And you get that relaxed kind of vacay feel, the color combo, complements each other in these two pieces. So definitely a win with this shirt if you're willing to spend a little bit more money. So there you go. <laughs> Don't worry, I have a bathing suit on. <laughs> I grabbed some swimwear, one bikini. Honestly, H&M surprises me all the time about the quality of their swimwear, the interest in the pieces. Some of them look very designer and the quality can be really, really great. So I wouldn't sleep on H&M swimwear. I picked up this bathing suit and being kind of brave by putting this on on camera, but um, just showing you as well how great of a beach cover up this linen shirt could be as well. But the detail in this swimsuit, it's got this beautiful kind of gold structural piece kind of going through the middle. It's a dark blue color bandeau style. I'm wearing a size two in the top. I'm quite small chested, but the bathing suit has quite a bit of stretch to it. So I really do like the fit of it. I have the bottoms on as well. I have my underwear on underneath. I am gonna keep this bathing suit so don't come at me that I'm trying it on. But the bottoms also have this little gold detail on one side and fit really, really nicely. Again, a lot of stretch. They don't feel too constricting. I'm in a two in the bottom as well. And this is a win for me. I'm keeping this bathing suit for sure. Yeah, I love the detail in the gold. Again, H&M with the expensive looking pieces. I'm super impressed. Okay, as we know, putting a little dress on in the summer is definitely the easiest route. Um, you should have kind of uh, a couple summer dress options in your wardrobe for sure. So I had to grab this one. 
Loved the detail in this. The shape of it is very pretty. It has a little tie back. Uh, linen blend fabric. The black and cream combination I think is so pretty and luxe. The sizing on this one is a little bit off for me. I grabbed a small. I probably could have gone extra small. I have a little bit of room in here and I feel like it's supposed to be a little bit more fitted through the midsection. So I would size down in this one, but the length is pretty good. I'm 5'8 or 9 and typically some of H&M stuff can run a little bit short on me, but the length on this is really great. You can adjust the length a little bit by pulling the straps a bit tighter. It shortens it up here a little bit. So I'd say overall this is a really nice option, um, but I would definitely size down in this one. Uh, I think it also came in a pant and shirt combination or maybe a longer dress as well but yeah I think this was really pretty as well so far so good while I have this dress on I will also show you a pair of shoes that I picked up for the summer I love a little strappy sandal and the detail in these is so cool this is a, a little rosette on the top of the sandal espadrille bottom and then a leather strap so let me pop these on and show you what they look like. Oh, they actually fit quite nice. Okay. How cute are these? I really like the detail of the rosette on the top of the foot. And the strappy sandal is quite pretty as well. They fit really well. H&M shoes, the sizing can be a bit tricky. Uh, I typically wear an eight and a half or a nine, but I always opt for an eight at H&M. That's what these are and they fit perfectly. So I would definitely size down in H&M shoes as well. I believe their eight converts to a Euro 39. So these I actually really love as well. How cute would these be for vacation or summer? Okay, another win, here we go. Okay, I was most excited to try on this set. This is so, so fun. The detail in the neckline is very Christopher Ezra, if you're familiar with that designer. He does a very similar structural detail in a lot of his pieces. So the color too is so, so good. Absolutely obsessed. This is a set, so it's a top and skirt combo. The slit has the same kind of structural kind of wobbly hemline, which is really pretty. I think this would be really nice for a summer event. You could even pull this off at a wedding too with a little heel. So as far as sizing goes, the top I'm in an extra small. It has a lot of stretch to it and I feel like with this neckline you want it to be nice and fitted through the bust line so you're not falling out. And with the skirt I went with a small because I didn't want it to be too too tight. I think it's a good fit. I personally would probably just keep the top and I my style is a little bit more casual so I'd probably pair the top with jeans or shorts but the combo together is so so pretty this is a win for sure the color it comes in a few other colors too I believe black and cream but the green is such a fun pop of color and it's obviously very trendy um, right now so you know what, I actually brought a pair of jeans, so why don't I throw those on at the top to show you that. All right, here is the top with a pair of light denim. I love this color combo. The green really looks quite nice with the light blue. So just to show kind of how you can break up the set, you could obviously wear the skirt with other top options as well, but I'm keeping this top 100%, it is so good. Uh, while I have this on, I might as well go through everything else. So this jacket I saw and it really reminded me of Ralph Lauren polo. They had a little jacket like this in the 90s. I think it was mostly menswear, but I was actually looking for the Ralph Lauren one on Poshmark because I don't know if they sell them anymore, but this one has a shoulder pad detail in it. So I grabbed the extra small because I didn't want the shoulders to be like too, too big. I think it fits quite nice. I love the simplicity in this jacket. Everyone needs like a light jacket option for those summer nights that it gets a little bit chilly. 
I mean, realistically, typically our summers in Ontario are quite warm for about two months and then it starts to taper off a little bit. So nice to have a light jacket option. I'll show you it zipped up. It does have the elastic waistband here as well as in the, the sleeves. I think this is really nice. It's cute and adds a little bit of structure with the shoulder pads. Yeah, I think the fit of this is good. I probably could have gone small as well, but I was a little bit worried that the shoulder pads would be a bit too much. So I think this is a great option. The color is beautiful. Quality is really nice. H&M's accessories are always a huge win for me. I feel like their sunglasses, some of their bags lately have been shockingly good. So super simple, but this little guy caught my eye. It's just a very simple, minimalist nylon bag with a leather strap. It's got a silver zipper detail, but I like how simple it is because sometimes you don't want the bag to be as much of a statement. So I think this is very pretty, easy, I like the nylon detail. It makes it feel a little bit more laid back and casual. And this one comes in a few different colors too, but I opted for the olive green. Again, hot color for this season, so love that one. Sunglasses at H&M I think are so good and always look designer inspired. So as we know, red has been a massive color this year and I wanted to add a little pop of red through accessories because not everyone wants to wear a full-blown red top or dress or whatever it may be so don't mind the tag on these but I grabbed this cat eye style acetate sunglass I really like the shape of them they're a little bit more subtle in the red because they have kind of almost like a clear detail to it, but really love the shape of these. I have quite a narrow face and I think these work quite well. I'll give you a little bit of a closer look. I really like them. I think, am I gonna end up keeping all of this stuff? Um, okay, and then these were really special as well because I'm sure you've seen the shield style sunglasses are really trendy right now. A lot of high-end designers are doing it. And these are that exact shield shape. They're big, they're oversized, retro. The color of them is really pretty. They've got a brown lens to them with the gold arm. I really, really like these as well. Don't mind the tag, but they look so cool and they're more of a statement, right? Again, the price point on these is 32, and the red ones are 22. So if you don't want to spend a ton of money on your sunglasses, H&M is a really great option for that. All right, that's all I got for today. Thank you so much for watching. I would say this was a huge success. H&M is killing it right now with their summer collection. So check us out next week on our new YouTube episode. Make sure you follow and subscribe and let me know which of these pieces was your favorite. See you next time.